Hey there, my name is Whitney Belkowitz, President and CEO of Intelligent Concrete. And today I'm going to be talking a little bit more about RCA or Recycled Concrete Aggregate. So the topic for today's talk is absorption. Um, that ends up being something that people kind of get hung up on and a lot of times if they don't know how to handle it um, can be a huge hurdle to overcome in maintaining you know a, a good concrete mix so the absorption for RCA um, can range anywhere from about 3% on the low end to shoot we've seen as high as 8% in our lab with different um, RCAs that we've worked with which is extremely high um, and that's not something where you can just throw it into a concrete mix and hope for the best you've got to do something to kind of deal with that absorption ahead of time so John and I did a research project on um, RCA kind of way back in the beginning when we first started looking at it and evaluating it and we did different things um, to try to handle that absorption um, one was just adding water to the um, aggregate ahead of time and doing a, I think it was a 30 second tumble in the mixer and then loaded the other um, materials as you normally would. Um, then we also tried different admixtures to make that work and see if that would have any different impact. Um, and it, it did, it was awesome. Um, we're actually doing a uh, sustainability webinar on that coming up here on the second. Um, but the point is, you know, when you see some sort of hurdle or obstacle, uh, especially with RCA that you have to overcome, I mean, it's just, it's really like with anything else, you have to kind of break it down and figure out the best way to approach it. Um, with absorption, you know, doing a quick pre-soak in the beginning, especially if you're adding a little something extra to help with the adhesion between that RCA and then what's going to become your cement paste, um, you can see pretty fantastic results. We were actually able to maintain fresh properties and even see an increase in hardened properties in some cases. So, you know, increased compressive strength and then increased durability um, further down the line. So there's a lot of different things that you can do uh, to make RCA work. It's totally worth the effort. It really is. Um, not only to do your part to contribute to the sustainability movement, but also just it's, it's aggregate that's readily available. So if you know how to use it, you can still get great concrete coming down the chute um, and not have to worry about these shortages that a lot of places are dealing with with virgin aggregate. So thanks so much for joining. Like, subscribe, ding that bell for notifications. Please throw any comments or questions down below. Go concrete, beat asphalt.